and just, you know, f for your life in cinema now, and you started in television in a lot of ways, and how television now has taken on some of those really yeah. complicated moments that we're yeah. talking about yeah. that used to be in cinema in the 70s. That's true. So, you know, Sopranos for a minute, or The Wire, or Breaking Bad, of course. But you go back to your TV days, could you ever have imagined that this is where it was going to be? When I was doing different strokes in The Facts of Life? Yeah, or this, watch this, look at this. Okay. I like this one. You That's take cool. the kids and Lenny. Who will come out on top, Nell or her kids? No party. Mother, you wound me. I will if you have a party in this house. You take the kids and Lenny. You take the kids, man. <laughs> Yeah, horrible, horrible, <laughs> horrible man. No, but look, so you worked on, that was most deaf. That's most deaf. That's a kid, most deaf yeah, in that. most deaf as a kid, yeah. Could you identify at that moment that most deaf would go on to be a very interesting performer? No, of course not. He was a funny guy, he was a good actor, he was a good kid. I, when I heard he was most deaf, I went, what? <laughs> and, and of course, yeah, I'd seen him. He looks basically the same, he was like 16 you, there. You take the kids as supposed to be kind of an African-American take on Roseanne, as, yeah. as I read about it. Pre-LA riots, pre-Rodney King, right, like 1990-ish. Yeah. That show today would be different, wouldn't it? Yes, it would be funny. Uh, this one <laughs> wasn't funny at all. Yes. It'd be well written, because someone else would write it, yes. Did you write all of them? Uh, no. no. You directed uh, no, it, right? I, I wrote the pilot with my friend, and I directed it, yeah. The friend you wrote it with, was they, were they white or black? Uh, white. It's a great exercise, right? Yes. How do you put together... It's ridiculous, but it's great. How did you put together the, the, the research or the concept of writing which is an important story, the African-American experience. Because Roseanne's an important sitcom. Yes. Yeah. Um, I didn't give that a lot of thought here, but this is before Crash. I mean, for Crash, I did a hell of a lot of research. I did lots, and I did a lot of interviews. I, I read a lot about, about the, the American experience for, for, for various people, and, and, uh, and I came to understand it in a very profound way before I, I wrote about it. And, and you just, if you can understand the given circumstances of a person's life, I think you can write that person. Right. And Crash in and, and, and America is more about class than race today. And that's a very <laughs> bad word to say. If right. You, you know, you just, no, we don't have a class society. Oh, yeah, we do.